So, but anyway, should we get to today's FaceTime Friday? We have a fun, you know, we're starting this. We did it last week with J.P. Kelly. Um, he's with um, KRON Radio in South Dakota. Mitchell, South Dakota. Mitchell, South Dakota. He joined us. We're, we're, we're friends. What are we calling this? Whatever we our want. Our Fridays are better with all our friends. Yeah. And family, come to find yes, out. Yes, because wait till you see who's next. So we're joined this morning for FaceTime Friday with a bunch of wonderful people that are hard workers that are i'm hoping they're hard workers from orleans nebraska we'd like to welcome to ntv's good life there are they hey, hey boot. i recognize you boot this, hey, it is going good this is this is my son i wish he could Ryder see us lewis is working hard at ag valley co-op there in orleans <coughs> what what are you up to today there boot well, we're we're loading up corn trucks right now. I'm actually excited to watch the other guys work, so I'm, I'm slapping right now. I raised a good one. I raised a good one. Yes. So, okay, so since I'm a city girl, you're on a corn truck, meaning it's getting loaded with corn? Is that what you mean? Yeah, we're loading it with corn, yeah, yeah. And then they're, they, they we load them with corn, and they're taking them down, like, to feed lots or ethanol plants down in Kansas. That's where we're loading our trucks to. So how, mu how much corn goes into that truck and how long does it take to fill the truck you're sitting in? Um, so it usually takes around two to five minutes. Oh, it's that's all. A bushel of corn, give or take. Okay. I, so, okay, because I have a tons of questions, but no, you go, go ahead. ahead. No, go ahead. Okay, so how many trucks are lined up behind you, Ryder? Um, so we just loaded one and another one's actually coming through the door right now to uh, get his paperwork and go on but so far we loaded um five trucks a day and there's two more here so i'll make seven as so, of right now. wow so how long does it take them to get so you said two to five minutes so they don't have to i saw a line of like 15 20 trucks the other day when i was on highway um six and 34 and i thought how long does it take them to get through that well it, and it also depends on we had a pretty nice facility here so some places that might take um five to ten minutes to load oh, a truck but okay. here quick so they don't have to wait too long okay that and, the, and the skill that comes in handy especially d when there's a lineup mm -hmm. is to be able to load it to the exact amount so they because you have to weigh a certain amount legally correct yes every truck has like most trucks all 80 85 5 and then 90,000 and it's, you try to load them as close as to their ways as they can take as possible Okay, so what if you go over like so much, you know, so many pounds? Do they have to dump it then? Yeah, yeah, they got to dump it to make sure that they're legal because they don't want to get pulled over by DOT and get in trouble that oh, way. Oh, okay. So you dump it right there, and then does it get recycled back up to where it has to go? Yes, yep, yeah, that's what we do. Yep. Am I asking silly no, questions? No, I'm asking because, city because, girl questions. But when you drive by and you see a lineup, you think, man, what are you doing? But most yeah. of the time now, they're, are you getting in any? I mean, I know that some farmers contract, so that means okay. they will bring their corn in at a certain time. Are you getting any of that, or is it mostly all all there? We've gotten a few farmers that have been coming in, but it's for farmers bringing corn in, it's kind of slower. But we've gotten a few farmers coming in the last few weeks. So how much corn is there on the property where you're working? Is there like tons and tons? Um, about around a million bushel or so. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's yep. a lot. Because I'm thinking a bushel of apples and to have a million of that, that's how my mind works because I don't do good math, but that's a lot, right? Yeah, but Ag <laughs> Valley in Orleans, you, what do you, you, you have corn and you have Milo, correct? So right yeah, we have corn and milo right now. We got most of our milo kind of picked up, and they we take it to Edison. They kind of ship it out on trains, but we do a lot of corn trucks. We ship out going south, like to Kansas, and that way. So when when everything is 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 like loaded and done for when does the season end for all this loading the trucks and stuff? Oh, the season. Oh, the only answer I can tell you is the season's over, per se, is when we're out of corn. And when is yep. that though? That's what I guess that was my next question. It when are you out of anything? Never. Really oh. add corn until harvest. So it's a continuous job like you're doing oh. it every day. Yep. Wow. Yeah. That's yeah, I you can tell I've never been to one of these facilities. Maybe I should come and do your job for oh, a that'd day. Be fun. So Ryder, I know fun. you work with three other people there at the Orleans location. They didn't want to be yeah. on or, or what's what's Jacinda doing? Well, 
with me and Dudley and Devin, there are loading trucks right now. Loading trucks right now. So. We'll, we'll give them a pass. Yeah. Because that comes first. Yeah, we will. <laughs> but, Ryder, it was good talking to you because I yes. don't think I've seen you this much all week. I think you're right. To be and with you. Did, did you bring me back a souvenir from Dallas? Did I? I brought everybody else something back but you. Sorry. Guys. Oh, my <laughs> God. Ryder, you are out of my will. I'm sorry. Well, you should be because my will. I guess huge. I could. Sh I could probably share. I could probably share. No, no. But it I'm a middle no, child. Doesn't so. mean the same. Anyway, Boot, the same. thanks for being with us. We appreciate your time this morning. <laughs> Thank you. I need to seriously. I need to come down there and do what you do. Yeah, you would love it. I you would. It would be. It's, it's interesting. Thanks, very. Boot. Yep. Thank you. See yep. you later. Talk to you later, bud. All yeah. right. So. Fridays are always very good with cool. family and friends. It's a very family interesting. Friday. It's it's very interesting, and I I couldn't be more proud of my boots. Yeah. Absolutely, yep. absolutely.